morning, super cool party people, and welcome back to this fun little storm that's happening outside here. The wind just chilled out, like, as I picked up the camera, but let me tell you, it's been bad. Oh, look, see, there it's going again. Look at that tree go. Look at it go. <laughs> oh, I want to go to the store today. Oh, yay. I um, woke up at, like, 7.30, and I've been up pretty much since because of the wind. Uh, I laid in bed until just recently. It's I think it's just after 9 now, I think. Maybe 9.30. Um, I put on a... Yeah, it's 9.30 right now. I put on a, a show and listened to that, <laughs> but the wind was pretty bad. I do want to go to the store. Oh, it is so bad. Like, look at that. <laughs> look at the screen door go. Yeah, it's like... 70 to 90k like I mentioned yesterday uh, Nice <laughs> I'm assuming you can hear that too on the mic <laughs> I find sometimes because it's like close to me you can't hear things, but that's pretty loud Anyways, so tonight I can't remember if I mentioned it yesterday, but we're gonna do a girls night here because it's my last night all the water taxi runs got cancelled because of this storm and um, because nobody wanted to go to work because of the weather and so we're gonna do a girls night and so I believe my breakfast buddy and Strudel's mom are gonna come over for dinner at like six ish and then at seven our two bosses lady bosses are gonna come over and we're gonna have like drinks and snacks and stuff. Well, I don't really have any snacks <laughs> to provide, but I found a very promising looking recipe for yeastless bread that only takes like just over half an hour to make. And so I thought that would be something fun to make. I definitely had a dream about trying to buy the ingredients for it, not at this store, but somewhere else. Anyways, um, so I need to go to the store to get those things because I want to do a trial in the morning. It's so bad. <laughs> like, these windows are soaked <laughs> from the rain. Uh, anyways, so I need to go to the store. The store is closed. That is very dangerous and very not inviting. So I think probably when I, I'll probably try to go within the next hour. <laughs> and then um, just run. Just run. So that's the current thought. Maybe it'll let up just a little bit. I don't know. Should probably get dressed so I can be ready, but I think first I'll have my breakfast drink and then we'll go from there. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm just waiting for like the next big blow to come through and then I'm gonna run. Or should I just go now? Should I just go now? Oh, it's terrible out here. If anyone can see me, I look so stupid. But everyone's inside! <laughs> Honestly, whoops, wrong light. I think that was the perfect time to go. It really wasn't that bad. Also, like, overkill. But I don't know. So, I have my list of things I need to buy. I need some garlic powder <laughs> and some salt and an excessive amount of sugar. <laughs> All right, that can go there. That can go there. That can go there. And then I think the only other thing I need is, oh wait, baking powder. Let me check my list. Yes, baking powder and then all-purpose flour. I think I'm gonna get a big all-purpose flour um, because eh, if I decide to make more bread, <laughs> like if this goes well, then um, I'll make a bunch of bread, I guess. <laughs> I'm gonna drop this camera in a second. And then because I have problems, <laughs> I'm gonna get <laughs> this bag of sugar from out here <laughs> and I'm gonna put it back on the shelf I should have just grabbed it from back there <sighs> but it's fine 
All right, now I'm gonna ring myself through, probably double bag it <laughs> because I'm gonna run again. <laughs> and then I'm gonna go attempt to make bread. Oh, I don't need my keys in my hand anymore because I have, um, duh, 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 locked the door again. Oh, is there somebody coming? That's rude. It's real rude. And now we wait again. I'm gonna turn off the lights. Is it a good time? I think, I think we're good. Oh no, oh no, oh no. <laughs> what is my life? It's not even that bad. I could easily walk. Oh no, it's getting worse. <laughs> Alright, this is actually okay. It's really rainy, but it's not so windy. <laughs> Alright, got the goods. <laughs> I think I picked the perfect window in which to go because it's getting really bad out there again. So yay me for just sucking it up and running out the door and running to the store. Um, I'm just <laughs> opening my laptop now to grab the recipe for the bread, but it looks like, it looks promising. It is like five different ingredients, um, one of them being water. I got the garlic powder because I thought I could make like a garlic butter and like make garlic bread later. All right, here we go, let's open this up. It's one of those recipes that has like the, this is my life at the beginning. Is it not going? Hello friend, let's try again. You know the one, the one that's like, oh, back in, 1923 my grandma made this for the very first time and you're like why why do i need to do this also i'm like really warm now from being outside <laughs> okay so it said put everything into one bowl and mix it together so i'm gonna i'm gonna start with that also it says line a cookie sheet with parchment paper i have neither of those things i don't have a cookie sheet and i don't have parchment paper um i do have a pyrex pan that'll probably work <laughs> All right, step one is getting a bowl out. I need this bowl. Oh, so heavy. And I need to get rid of those. Okay, I guess basically what we'll do from here is we'll just time lapse my efforts, right? Let's do that. I got a confession. Been losing all momentum. But just because it's easy. I absolutely picked the perfect time to go down because even while I was making bread, it was just like howling like crazy. So the bread, oh, like it's, it's real bad right now. <laughs> also, my uh, cabin is way too hot because I have the oven on. I'm just waiting for it to heat up, but like the bread's looking like the picture, I think. I got a bit of a mess here. I'm gonna make more of this for tonight for the girlies if it works out. Hoping it works out. <laughs> Um, and then I'm gonna eat that and I have bacon to cook for myself for now, so that's exciting. But like, I'm so glad that <laughs> I went when I did because yeah, it's just way worse. The um, boat way down at the end, you can't really see it. It's right there. They're um, fish net cleaners. Um, so they go to the fish farms and they clean the um, nets there and stuff. They've been here all week and I don't know why. I don't know if it's because they deemed the weather too bad because like yesterday it was perfect or if they're harvesting where they want to be or something. I'm not really sure. <laughs> but they're all the way on finger seven, which is the furthest one from the ramp. And that was the guy that I saw coming up when I was in the store. He had to obviously go down and get more food or whatever from the boat. So that's that sucks. That sucks much worse than my adventure. Although I was screaming a bit like a maniac as I was running over, so there's a chance he heard me, which I think is hilarious. Anyway, <laughs> I'm currently transferring the footage from yesterday's vlog. Um, it's gonna be like another 10 minutes. And then by that point, I should be able to put the bread in and then I'll edit that later. I should probably start packing at some point too. It's not even noon yet. So I'm feeling like I'm doing all right and I need to send an invoice to my boss for my counting of the inventory. And then I'm gonna probably check out invoicing later and maybe um, do some of that. Oh my God, it's so windy. <laughs> like The spray coming off the water it's crazy anyways that's the current plan is to try to be productive um after i bake this bread i think the internet is out <laughs> either that or it's just doing the least i've been trying to load gmail for like the last four or five minutes <laughs> 
it's not looking promising. And if I can't load Gmail, then I can't send my invoice and I can't do invoicing because it's all online. So I guess we can tentatively cross those off the list for today. It's just, it's getting worse. <laughs> I keep hearing all these weird noises and I like keep expecting, like see that noise? I'm pretty sure it's the, the scream, but I keep expecting the barbecue to be like rolling into the side of the uh, <laughs> building. <laughs> Oh, fun times. <laughs> I'm so glad I went to the store when I did. Oh dear. <laughs> so yeah, I don't even know if, I mean, if this doesn't blow through, I don't know if anyone's gonna wanna come over here today and I get that. <laughs> so anyways, the bread is now in the oven because I was gonna do it after I sent this email, but that's not happening. Thank God I got the recipe up before the internet went down um, or I would have had to wing it on the temperature. And, um, yeah, so it's 15 minutes at one temperature and then I drop it and then hopefully I can eat it and then I'll make some bacon and I'll have a delicious lunch. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go because I feel like today I'm just gonna be giggling the whole time about the ridiculousness of this weather. Like, if it like are, if it's really bad, am I even gonna go into town tomorrow? I don't know. <laughs> they, they have appointments in town, so like, it'd have to be really bad for us not to go, so <laughs> we'll see. I'm literally just sitting in here. This is like calm right now compared to what it's been. <laughs> just laughing maniacally, cause it's so fun. I love it, I love it so much, especially cause I don't have to be out in it. Oh, it's so nice. <laughs> but definitely glad that there's nobody here because every time it gets like really bad, I'm just like, ah! <laughs> Uh, the bread is coming along though. We're in the last three minutes. Um, that's what it looks like at the moment. Looks like bread, it has risen. And surprisingly, there's a cooling rack. So that's exciting. So I'm gonna pull it out and then I'm gonna cook my bacon and then just hope that it's good. <laughs> but yeah, I'm trying to send this invoice still. Um, internet keeps going down naturally because of the weather, so. We'll see. <laughs> I have started editing the remainder of the vlog from the last two days. Uh, I'm just rendering everything now because I fixed everything that needed to be time lapse. But yeah, this is, I, I betcha the TV's out too. I haven't tried to turn it on because I've been listening to music, but that's where we're at. I love this. I love this so much. <laughs> out there I've unplugged the mic so hopefully <laughs> it'll start up again oh my god I got an email from my boss and the subject line was suggestion and the body just said don't go outside and I'm <laughs> the whole cabin is shaking <laughs> But I was like, yeah, I went out earlier. I'm so glad. It was not even bad when I went out. Oh my God, it was not bad at all <laughs> compared to what it is now. It's insane. Oh, yeah, I will not be leaving the house anytime soon. I'm just making, so the bread I made, and it tastes more like a biscuit than bread, which makes sense because it was um, baking soda versus, or baking powder versus yeast. And so, I'm trying to make it into some garlic bread right now because if that works, then I'll make a couple more loaves um, and then do that tonight. Two things I learned were, one, I should have cooked it longer, and two, I think I'm gonna make it into like smaller loaves and it should cook better. But yeah, overall, pretty all right. But anyways, I'm just living through this. I'm working on the vlog from yesterday. I have about 10 minutes left to go and let's see. 30 seconds left on the bread.
Yep. <laughs> I love it. Okay, that duck quacking was my timer, so I'm gonna pull that out now and hopefully consume it. It'll be good. Oh my god, like, look at this! <laughs> oh also, it's warmer in here, obviously, than it is outside. Oh, fun times. Alrighty, well, it's a lot later. I feel like I have to yell over the rain. I probably don't have to, so I should probably stop. It's getting darker now. I, th I thought it was gonna blow through by this point, but it's really just as bad as it has been, if not worse at some points. Um, but I did get, like I did the dishes, everything but my computer is packed up out here basically. And I'm mostly packed in here. Um, I just have like, I don't know, I can only do so much until I'm packing everything up. I hope we're not leaving super early tomorrow, but I'm pretty sure we're probably leaving at like 7.30. So, you know, if you have it like, 6.30, it'll be okay. I should actually probably pack up some of the food I'm not taking for uh, my breakfast buddy because I said I'd leave her food, but I don't know, we'll figure it out. She should be coming over at some point. I think her and Strudel's mom are gonna come over at like six-ish. I think not 100% sure on Strudel's mom to have dinner and then at like 7.30 everybody else is gonna come over and I'm gonna make bread for, more bread for that. Um, I think I'm gonna make two loaves this time and cook it longer and maybe coat the top with some, I don't have butter, but margarine to crisp it up a bit, but I will do that soon. Once some of this stuff dries, I guess, and then I can like mix the dry stuff at least and it'll be okay. Anyway, that's the current update. I'm also uh, contemplating buying my CPU. <laughs> I'm just gonna search on a couple different sites and see if it's cheaper elsewhere. I'm the worst. <laughs> Alrighty, so it's just about six, and let me tell you, I am so glad that everybody is coming here and I don't have to go outside in this, because it's real bad. Um, not sure Strudel's mom is coming still. I think my breakfast buddy went over to her cabin to ask her, because she hadn't responded to, the to any of the messages. Um, but I think my breakfast buddy's plan is to be here or head over within the next 10 minutes. So I'm gonna put this away and I'm gonna put that away and I'm just gonna chill and wait for it to show up. So that's where we're at. Um, I will check in with you afterwards because we're just gonna chill. I'm not gonna vlog it. And um, yeah, see you later. Alrighty, so it is just after midnight. My hair is doing a weird thing. We're just gonna go with it. Um, everybody stayed over until like just before 11, I think. We had the bread that I made and someone brought cheese. There was wine and crackers and chats and puppies and good times. And it was so nice. It was such like a nice evening. I think like 7.30. Yeah, like another three hour meeting. I've been so social since I got out here. Like I've been more social in like the week and a bit that I've been out here than I've been since the summer where I lived with everybody and so I could see everybody regularly too. So like, I mean, I'm basically, like I mentioned the other day, still in the bubble because all I added was my mom and her boyfriend who I live with, my friend who I go walking with was still in the bubble from out here because he was working out here until he almost died. So yeah, fun times, it's been great, it's been nice. I'll be glad to go home tomorrow though so I can like do things like embroider and sew and open all my mail that has showed up. There should be a bunch of computer parts that have showed up. I think everything except for my keyboard will have showed up and obviously the things that I haven't ordered yet. <laughs> Still trying to decide on the CPU. So torn on that, but that's okay. So anyways, I think I'm gonna go now and sleep because I have to be up early, but not as early as I thought. We're gonna go, we're gonna take our own boat tomorrow um, so we don't have to link up with a charter, which means we're not leaving here till like nine o'clock. So that's fantastic. And also the kids aren't going. So it'll just be me, my two bosses and the puppy because um, puppy has a vet appointment tomorrow. But yeah, all exciting things. <laughs> I'm pretty tired now though, so I think I'm gonna go to sleep. Uh, so with that, I'm going to say thank you for coming along on such a fun storm day. Um, it's pretty much blown through now, in case you're wondering. And I will see you in the morning when we continue this. Good night. Good morning, super cool party people, and welcome to the last morning here in Blind Channel. 
I am awake. It is just after eight. I have everything in the bedroom packed up and I just have <laughs> this pile on the table to deal with. But first, I'm gonna do my breakfast drink <laughs> and watch a little bit of TV while I wake up the rest of the way because this should just take me like two seconds to stuff everything in there or in there because this is nice and packed. I can't believe today's last day, like in parts I feel like it has flown by and then other parts I feel like it has dragged because I have been here for 10 days, which is crazy. It's the most, well, it's the most I've been here in one go, I think, when it hasn't been the summer, I think. I don't know. My first November here might've been 10 days. Am I just crazy? I don't know. I'm definitely not awake. So I'm gonna wake up and then, um, like I said, finish packing. I have to be down on the dock and on the boat, which I'm not sure what boat it is, at five to nine. So I got lots of time. So no rush. Alrighty, so I've got everything packed up here. As you can see, I just kind of threw everything together because I was like, whatever. <laughs> I just have to put this camera in. Um, I've got my sweater, my sweater and my jacket right there, which you can't really see because they're dark and it's dark. I got my phone for my pocket and the cap for this. And then I'm good to go and it's about 22. So I'm gonna start putting on the rest of the layers and going down and yes, it is not bow tied. <sighs> That's amazing. And um, I think, <laughs> I'm so sad this lens doesn't zoom as much. So not the first boat landing craft here, but the one on the back side. I think Mainlander is the one we're on. So yeah, I'm gonna go down and probably next time I see you, we'll be in town. So I'm currently home. And as you can see, I have a Millie. Um, she has to go to the vet today, which is why she's in town. Cause she's got a little bit of a rash, but um, everybody had to run around and do stuff slash had appointments, etc. So she's just hanging out with me for a couple hours and we're just having a chill time. We were just cuddling on the couch. Also, I have like this massive pile of um, whatever mail to get through. So that'll be a later thing. I was gonna go to work um, early, later. Oh, it's so bright. I was gonna go to work later, but I think I'm just gonna go tomorrow instead because come on. Oh. And then I'd be at work until like seven and I don't wanna do that. Yeah, anyways. We're gonna go for a walk in a bit, I think. Yeah, she's so sweet. I love her, I need a puppy. Hello. <laughs> I have a lot of packages. <laughs> Is that better? I think that's slightly better. I can't even get close to my desk because they just keep going. Um, and my new tower for my computer is down here. I'm just gonna start. So this one is exciting, and I actually ordered it while I was in Blind Channel, so that was fast. Um, but it's a new Joby Gorillapod um, tripod for my GoPro, because I realized when I was in Blind Channel that my GoPro tripod is broken. So this one's pretty much the same as what I have, except this one has this um, joint, like the ball joint here. It has a level on it which is really exciting. And then it's got the GoPro mount at the top. So you can slide it in and it also comes with one that looks like you can screw right in if you don't wanna use this. So that's exciting because I needed that. And I was kind of like, oh, I really need to like plan for replacing things because <laughs> I've just been breaking things in the last couple months. I'm gonna put my hair up because it needs a shower. <laughs> okay, let's get back into this. There should be I think it's mostly computer parts, except this. This is exciting. Do you remember like, I think it'd be probably yesterday's vlog when I got really excited because I figured out the um, company that sells the boxes. And this here is those flat pack boxes that work perfectly for um, my little embroidery hoops, the three inch ones. So here they are. Nice, um, just a pack of 30 because I figured nine wasn't enough and 70 was too much, 30 is probably too much, but that's fine. Let's go with this one now. Oh, I think I know what this is. So when I build my computer, I decided I didn't want to build it with Wi-Fi, um, just because I think like a cable is, you're gonna be more consistent, and if I wanna stream, then that's better. So I got 150 feet of um, Cat6 Ethernet cable, and it's nice because it's flat as well. Um, so I should be able to run it from here to where it needs to go pretty easily. Did I need 150 feet? Absolutely not. I'm pretty sure I had this conversation, but I was like, I think 100 might not be enough. Right, 
Next. <laughs> ah, I was like, what is this? So two, two more exciting things. These are clips that are clearly stuck to each other um, for the ethernet cable. It comes with a couple, but these ones are sticky, as you can tell. And also these ones are like specifically for flat ones. I wish I had never opened that. We'll just hope that nothing falls out of that. And then I also picked up a um, UV filter lens for this lens now that I have a new lens because I feel like it adds like an extra layer of protection. So I will screw that on. You know what? I could probably do that right now. No, I need to probably clean that lens. I'll do that after. Okay, next. <laughs> this one is from No Real Idea. I'm pretty sure this is a computer part. Ah, yes. It's my RAM. I got 16 gigs. Okay. <laughs> Let the camera just fell. Anyways, I got 16 gigs of the T-Force Delta RAM. It is not focusing um, to start because I figured that'd be good. Also, it lights up, which is cool. And it's um, DDR4 RAM. And then, what's this? Oh, this is my crucial one terabyte P5 solid state um, hard drive. Why is focusing so bad? So that's exciting. That's another component of my build. And then I'm gonna leave that till after because that's fabric and that's fun. Let's go with this giant box here. This is also fun. And this will actually solve that issue that I just had. A box in a box. So this is a stand that can mount to my desk that can hold my camera so it doesn't fall down. It can also extend too, which is nice. Like, well, it can extend. I'm not gonna screw around with it right now, but uh, last, before I left, I got the um, ball mount to go on top with a quick release. So that'll be great. And then that won't fall down. Oh my goodness. I'm running out of space. I guess we'll go with this next. This could be my motherboard, maybe? Ah, yes. It's my AS Rock B450M Steel Legend. Look at that. It's so pretty. Cool, 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 cool. So with that, I can, I could start putting that in my case, to be honest. We'll see how I feel. I don't know if I'm gonna wait till I get everything, like the things I haven't ordered, but we shall see. All right, let's do the fabric next. So this is a pre-order that I made in September. Yes, it is January. I think it got delivered on like the second. <laughs> oh look, I got a gift of Pikachu socks. That's pretty cute. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go through this quickly. So this is from Fangirl Fabric. I ordered, I've ordered a few times from her. I literally just placed an order like two days ago. Somebody stopped me. Um, and this was a pre-order, which is nice because then there's not that rush when she restocks. So I got the cute little dude from Frozen. He's so adorable. I got this Mario stuff. I got these D20 dice, or I guess it's not just D20 dice, uh, just Dungeons and, Dungeons and Dragons dice. Wow, English is hard. I got these super cute Pokemon. I got this fun Legend of Zelda like stained glass print one. The print's a lot smaller than I thought it was gonna be, but I actually kind of like that better. I got cacti, because who doesn't love a good cacti? I got this um, Deathly Hallows Harry Potter print, which I thought would be super cute for scrunchies. I got this Stitch and um, what's that guy's name? Scrump? Yeah, which I, I love Stitch. Stitch is probably my favorite um, character in Disney. I got this Harry Potter print, which is about 80% smaller than I thought it would be. Like, you can barely see that. <laughs> Anyways, that's fine. We'll make it work. I got this really cute Baby Yoda print. Look at him. He's just living his best life. I got this Nightmare Before Christmas one. See, this is like the size that I kind of thought the Harry Potter one would be way off. <laughs> I got Disney dogs because everybody loves a good Disney dog or dog in general. And then I got this last one that's like neon flamingos and two cans and stuff. Yeah. All right, we'll have to give that a wash. And then let's do this. This is gonna be a good time is what it's gonna be. 
she's pretty. She's big. Ta-da! <laughs> That's probably as much as I'm going to pull it out. It is the um, Be Quiet 500 case with the, um, whatever this is, glass side. Um, it also has, is this the top? Yeah, it's got a mesh top here that's removable, so you can either remesh or not mesh. Um, ee! And then it comes with two fans in it. No, this must be the top. Yeah, so this one, uh, you can put the mesh on or leave it off or you can have a solid top. <laughs> so there we go, that's it. This is the situation. <laughs> and I still have more stuff on the way for my computer. I need to probably make the decision soon on my CPU. I could, I almost bought it Wells and Blind Channel, but then I was like, I don't know. I'm leaning towards the Ryzen 7 3700, but we'll see. Anyways, I'm gonna tidy up and I'll check in with you in a bit. Alrighty, well, hello. Look, you're levitating. Um, I decided to put the stand here for the moment because I don't know where I wanna have it behind my desktop. So we're just gonna go here for now and just kinda hope for the best. Um, I've been chilling. I got most of my laundry or my clothes unpacked, like the suitcase is empty. I did not put them away because they all need to be hung for the most part. So I just stacked them on top of my sewing machine, which I have not been using forever. It's fine. <laughs> and then I put all my dirty clothes in the hamper, including my new fabric, which hopefully I'll wash maybe tomorrow. And I've just been puttering. I've got my stack of computer stuff here. I'll let you in on a secret. I don't remember if I mentioned it, but um, I bought another one of these while I was in blind channel. So I'll actually have 32 gigs from the start, um, which is maybe overkill, but Awesome. I'm so excited to be able to plug this in and make it work. Um, next week, I think on Tuesday, I should be getting my keyboard. So I think at that point, I'll probably try to figure out spacing a little bit. Maybe move the TV. I don't know. Very exciting things. But currently, I'm freezing because it's only like 20 degrees in here. And also... I put on my pajama shorts when I got home and I'm regretting that now. So I think <coughs> I'm gonna find some pajama pants instead of the pajama shorts and maybe turn on the heat for a bit. And then slowly, I don't think I'm gonna try to do anything productive tonight um, because like, why would I? <laughs> I think I'm just gonna, oh, I should send my invoice to my boss tonight for invoicing because it's a little late because normally I try to send it on like the first of the month and it's the sixth, but I didn't have this very important agenda here that I keep track of my hours. So maybe I'll do that tonight, <laughs> except I feel kind of bad because I'm just like, hey, give me money. Hey, give me money. Hey, give me money. <laughs> I know it's a job. I don't know. It's weird. I know it's weird. But yeah, I think I'm just going to putter tonight, not do much. I, I can smell dinner. So it's probably actually done pretty soon. So maybe I should go down and check in that. Um, but yeah, okay. I'm gonna stop rambling now because I'm saying nothing important. So I just realized that between all the footage I have of me just like having a grand old time with the storm and that unboxing, this is probably gonna be a really long video. So it's 20 to eight, I am gassed. I might split into two um, if it's too much, but I think I'm gonna climb my bed now, maybe put a show on and um, get ready to sleep. So with that, Thank you for coming along on these last couple days of adventuring adventures and all that fun stuff. Glad to be home. Excited to sleep under my weighted blanket again tonight. I feel like I missed it while it's gone. And um, I will see you bright and early tomorrow morning when I go back to work. <laughs> Good night.